most 155 pounders. Lots of differences to consider. The Brazilian is more senior by nine years. Trinaldo did miss weight yesterday. Division. Introducing to you first, fighting out of the blue corner. This mixed martial artist stands six feet, one inch tall. Weighing it officially 156 pounds. His professional record stands at 10 victories and one defeat. Fighting out of Wolverhampton, England. Here is Jai Black Country Banger Herbert. And across the octagon, his opponent fighting out of the red corner. His background is in kickboxing and jiu-jitsu. At five feet, nine inches tall, he weighed in over the limit, 160 pounds. His professional record, 25 victories with seven defeats. Fighting out of Brasilia, Brasil. Here is Francisco Massaranduba Trinado. And your referee in charge of the action is Herb Dean. Herb Dean, third man in the octagon. Thank you very much, Red. Couple of knockouts with us here on Fight Island, Red and Camila. We have Francisco Trinaldo, the veteran. Ready. Ready. Taking on the newcomer, Jai Herbert from Wolverhampton. He is wearing the black, Trinaldo in the white. Watch out for that seven inch reach advantage from Herbert. Really nice straight punches. It's going to be like a wood chipper trying to get through those for Trinaldo. Look at the movement. I just love it. It's, it's slick, it's light, it's agile. Snap, 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 keeping that lead hand so busy. Forcing Masaranduba to walk through something all the time. On the mat, oh! the best in the UK down at Team Renegade. Really credits Tom Breeze and Leon Edwards with a lot of we're seeing in front of us. Big Both left kick to the body there. I think Trinaldo hurt him a little yeah, bit with that I body think you're kick. Right, because he went searching for it with the left hook as well, straight after. Oh! Jai's got to get out of there. He doesn't. This is not where he wants to be with Trinaldo, and you can see Trinaldo was overextending a little bit to get in there, and that was the opportunity for Herbert to really capitalize on. He did sting him with a nice right hand, but this is where Masada Nduba wants to be inside here. Look for these takedowns, and he. I'm telling you, on top, he's a. He's a pain uh, in the you-know-what. I right. bet he is. And that's where you're going to feel that old man strength, that 40-something-year-old strength, yeah. with, and the extra five pounds as well. And, and his elbows yeah. feel like Masada Duba, which is like a <laughs> redwood. You know, like crazy yeah. wood. Yeah, it, Brazilian redwood, right? You could look at my eyebrow, Dan, and it's still mangled from this man. <laughs> well, actually, I heard. I think my yeah. skull was hanging out. Oh, oh gee. Yeah, I was there, actually. The whole thing. Wasn't... Yeah, the, whole, the entire thing. <laughs> Give my whole head back. <laughs> Oh, Sorry, John. That's okay. But it's, John has got to be careful of his neck on the way up. And Trinaldo does have a solid guillotine, so... Yeah, that is looking oh, powerful. That's just on the he's face. Through. That is looking really nasty. He's got to fight the hands. Which it looks like he's doing. Difficult yep. for us to see. But he is really flexing oh into this. The thing is, if he's Jai out. Herbert he's got a great job there by Herbert. If Jai Herbert can get through this, he's got to think, what was that weight cut like? If he was five pounds overweight, is he going to slow down? Is he going to burn himself out? It's the very first time Trinaldo has missed weight, though, so something is amiss. He does yeah. not make a habit of it. A true professional. Could be the amount of traveling. Yep. Could be so many different things. Sure. Could, could be an undisclosed injury as well, yep. something that stopped him doing his road work or his, you know, his conditioning. Again, something. If I'm if I'm Jai Herbert, I'm thinking I want to push this guy into the later rounds. Oh yeah, this is ideal for him. Yeah, to make him work, make him squeeze, make him grab my neck. Yeah, already managed to turn him. I tell you what, though, I could have done with Francisco Tonaldo to get this coconut water open with the squeeze that he got. Yeah, my goodness. <laughs> Having some problems with these bottle tops over here. Just show him it, and it'll probably open for you. <laughs> He's a maniac in the gym, according to his coaches. They have to literally tell him to stop as he spins this one down. That's he nice. gets back a lot, too, I think, uh, to the youth ar around where, where he's yeah, from. Yeah, he does. Really, yeah, really yeah helps six to out. 14 year olds. He's got, a, he's got a social project. He wants to be a great role model for them. The danger here is giving his back. He's doing a great oh, job. In trying to keep net. himself against the fence. He, he's got to keep scraping Francisco Trinaldo off. That Here's was a the elbow. elbow. God, man, he's so vicious with this top pressure here. Jai did a good job of getting up before, but now even Trinaldo might be wearing out, but so is him because now yep. he's fighting to get up. At least Trinaldo's working from top position. This is a nice spot for Trinaldo as well, adjacent to the to the fence like that. Two great fighters in his corner as well, in Tom Brees and Aiden Lee. Two guys that are going to be able to push Jai Herbert 
but probably not with this kind of top pressure and strength in such a compact frame. One thing that's interesting about the guys from this gym, they're all long, rangy individuals. Tall, long reach, nice jab, but this is just not a good position for him to get stuck in. It looks to me as well like Ronaldo. Yeah, he is, isn't he? It looks like he's trying to start a bit quickly here as well. Again, questions about his conditioning with him missing weight. This is where Jai's got to separate. He doesn't want to keep pressing Ronaldo up against the fence because at any point he can turn it around and take you down. So from here, get that separation. I like the knees up the middle, but I still feel like he's got a better chance with that jab. Oh, that was a good knee. Oh, but he took oh, another big left hand on the way out. Is that a cut on Trinaldo's shirt? Uh, is that a cut on Trinaldo's uh, cheekbone? Did that knee get through for you? Take down, yes. Nice, nice Trinaldo's play there feet. by Herbert. Watch the elbows now from Herbert. Heavy, heavy, heavy. Oh, this is 10 seconds this in the is going to take round. a lot out of Trinaldo going into the yes. second round for sure. Solid first hey, round. Hey, Good exchanges. Hey, hey. Work there by Herbert sends Ronaldo tumbling down to the canvas. Beautiful. Plus, main card at nine in the East prelim starts at six. Oh, what a right hand! Work there by Herbert sends Ronaldo tumbling down to the canvas. Beautiful, Strong. great right, right down the pipe. If I'm him, I'm getting back to my feet here because Masaran is going to be hurt. He's clinging on here. Jai Herbert needs to start creating some space to force a striking exchange. I mean, just that one knee that he did, the damage that he did to the cheekbone, and the ease at which it was, he was able to bring it up to the headline. Yeah, he's using his physical attributes very well, and everything's sharp on Jai Herbert. He's got that long, slender frame. That Lovely, nice. look at that back. work. Look at that work, very nice. Masaran Duba's moving to the right direction, though, to nullify that, yeah. uh, that, that potential body triangle. Jai Herbert's trying to get the legs crossed. But Masaran Duba sitting on that uh, that thigh. Hooks are in now. Beautiful work here by Jai Herbert. Potential rear naked choke, but Masaran Duba took his chin very well. It's a nice start to round number two for the UFC newcomer, Jai Herbert. We've got a shout out on social media from his favorite Wolverhampton Wanderers this week. Beautiful back control. Beautiful back control, really nice. And he can take his time here, three minutes and 30 left, as he's trying to swim that arm underneath the chin of what? Ronaldo. Only one submission on his uh, record, and that was a rear naked choke. But he is stuck to him like a backpack. Yeah, Trinaldo's trying his best to turn in, get wrist control, but Jai Herbert all over it. Every time Trinaldo makes a move, he adjusts to it. Whether it's letting go of that body triangle and just keeping his hooks in, he's got his feet crossed right now, which is going to give Trinaldo an opportunity to turn here because Trinaldo's got a good control on the wrist, double Beautiful. grip there. But Jai making his adjustments. He had that foot, he had that left foot on the inside of his thigh that just kept him hooked onto the back. Trinaldo's trying to pull that arm across now. He's going to try and turn into his guard here. This is where Herbert's uh, hooks are going to come into around. play. This is good work from Trinaldo now. It he's is going to come out the back door, possibly. It Getting is. rid of a hook. See, so, Herbert's so tall, it's hard to get those. There he goes. Off. Nice work there from Trinaldo. Beautiful oh, job. Nice. Oh, that's a labored get up there from yeah. Trinaldo, however. And a knee. Oh, he's slowing down. Watch the right hand. Oh. Exchange kicks. Oh, oh, and Herbert. Left hand from Trinaldo. Oh, gets we got clipped. a scrap here, man. What a fight so far. Oh, and another nice knee from Jai Herbert. Masaran Dubas doing a dance. That right hand's gonna find its way through the guard while he's wiping that blood away from his face. Oh, these are labored shots from Trinaldo. I did notice the cut man didn't quite manage to get some grease in that cut before he was off his stool, so that cut's wide open. And you can see him double guarding hard. He's still hurt. He's exhausted. I think Herbert should look to go to the body, body a little kick, bit here. Yes. Oh, there goes that knee again, and he's starting to look loose, is Herbert. Look at him. He's holding his hands nice and relaxed. In and oh, out. And again. It is a ravishing right hand from Herbert. That is electric straight through the guard. Oh, Masaran Duba's hurt still. Look at the patience of Jai Herbert fighting like a mature individual, not at all making his UFC debut. Lining that right hand up again. 
Overreaching is Trinaldo. Every time he's, he's oh, stung again with that right hand. He cannot oh. get overconfident though. He is facing a man with a lot of wisdom inside that octagon. Lovely footwork and feints. I just wonder, I wonder what shape Trinaldo is coming in as well. I mean, missing that weight might have not just been because of weight cut issues. It could have been because of training camp issues. Oof. Really good job picking oh, at the dear. body as well. And nice the, uppercut to the body. The defenses of Trinaldo are looking a little porous now as Herbert looks to try and sneak that long knee through. A brief moment here, 45 seconds. Where's this round gone? <laughs> Well, a lot of a lot of back mount work. Oh, and again but... with the knees. Trinaldo surviving though, he's still in there. I think it's Trinaldo's face that's made out of redwood. <laughs> <laughs> nice inside leg kick though from Trinaldo. Look at the strikes though. Trinaldo's got to use his jab to close this distance against her. He's going to just keep yeah. eating that right hand. But that seven inch reach advantage working very nicely for Herbert. Well, that inside, inside leg kick. kick definitely got some movement. Last 10 seconds in round number two. Ooh. Taking bites out of him with every shot. We'll be back with round number three after this. Lights, weights, fixture. The veteran Trinaldo versus the newcomer. Jai Herbert. Masuan uh, Duba's corner telling him he's got to use his boxing, he's got to use his feints. Jai Herbert is just a he's just a, a mess of movement. You just can't keep a track of the guy, and that right hand keeps stinging through the center of the guard. The body kick from Trinaldo. Yeah, Trinaldo has a really good rear leg body kick right to that liver. Also, really nice inside leg kicks. But Herbert just keeps sniping that right hand right down the middle. Right. There was a word that his corner used, masterclass. That's exactly the right word to be using here because it's not necessarily what he's doing, it's what they want him to do. There are glimpses of perfection in his movement, but then he gets caught in a brawl and he doesn't need to. That jab is just lovely. It's just oh, and covered on the right hand. There's a lot of energy being used in Herbert's style, though, on the outside. Must be in really good condition to be able to adopt that. Yeah. Taking that body kick well as well, Masaranduba powering through with the left hand to the chest. Just effortless with that. Oh! What a knockout! Oh! It's not over. Come on! It's not over. Stop the fight! Oh, that's it's the done second now. Time now Dan. Ronaldo gets the win by knockout. That's two times now. Against the run of play. You know, I'm wow. going to give a lot of credit to Trinaldo in that moment right yes. there where he could have just started Absolutely. teeing up, but he saw what we saw, and that fight should have been stopped. Absolutely.